Another delay for a history-making space mission, the Polar Dawn, a SpaceX project, has hit a snag. But the plan after liftoff is for members of the civilian crew to take a walk high above Earth in zero gravity, the first ever organized by a private company. CTV's Allison Bamford is on this beat today. And Allison, what does the holdup mean for the mission? Well, Sandy, this is a bit of a setback. Thanks to a helium leak, the mission that should have launched today is now delayed at least 24 hours. The team detected the leak in ground side equipment that's involved in the launch, but the company says the spacecraft itself remains healthy. The four person crew is made up of two SpaceX engineers, a retired Air Force pilot and a billionaire entrepreneur who helped fund the mission. They'll make history when two of them perform the first ever civilian spacewalk. They're pushing the envelope in, in multiple ways, not just with the spacewalk. They're also going to a much higher altitude with a more severe radiation environment than we've been to since Apollo. The mission extends past the International Space Station where two astronauts, Sonny Williams and Butch Wilmore, are stranded after helium leaks created issues for NASA's Boeing Starliner test flight in June. Over the weekend, NASA announced the Starliner will return to Earth in September without the astronauts, citing safety reasons. Our core value is safety and it is our North Star. Instead, Williams and Wilmore will hitch a ride back to Earth with SpaceX during a mission in February. As for the company's Polaris Dawn mission, the earliest takeoff is now Wednesday morning. Sandy? All right, hitching a ride. Thanks, Allison.